SCHPC. Boom. Oh my fucking god. That was the biggest grind I've done so far. But look at this thing, bro. It looks fucking sick. Fuck my. Ugh. It's boss, man. <laughs> Please. What the shit? Let's go, bro. Um, hello everyone and welcome back to Terraria Calamity, and if you remember last time, we actually took on four bosses, being the Queen Slime, Aquatic Scourge, Cryogen, and Brimstone Elemental, but today's episode, the plan is to actually take on two bosses, maybe three if we have enough time, but we're going to be taking on Plantera, maybe Golem, and then, where's this guy, this person, Calamitous Clone, never seen this guy before, looks like the Akfulu. But what we're actually going to do first is one of you guys recommended that I get a certain weapon. I've been doing a bit of research on this weapon. It's called the SHPC, I think. It's made out of certain parts found in labs. Now, I find one of these labs. Each one of these labs contains one of the items I need. But I'm going to have to find three more of these fucking labs. So this is going to take a very long time. I'm going to have to do so much fucking caving. It's going to be crazy. But we're going to try our best to get this before Plantera. And, um, and we'll give it a shot. And probably go and get some glorified armor as well. Because I want to be extra strong, you know? <laughs> No way, bro. It's actually been another 30 seconds. Oh my gosh. It's fucking over. We find it. I did dig across the entire world to get it. Jesus Christ, man. Boom. Okay, now that they're worth back. Jesus Christ. They can put all this shit away that I caught from doing that. There we go. SHPC, I think. There we go. SHPC. Boom. Oh my fucking god. That was the biggest grind I've done so far. But look at this thing, bro. It looks fucking sick. Okay, so how this weapon works, I think there's two firing modes. There's like a right click and then a left click. So the left click is this uh, thing that shoots out a bunch of balls and they will explode into like a multi-damaging firework looking thing. And then you have this fucking machine gun looking shit. No, this is awesome. Look at that, bro. Boom, 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 boom. <laughs> Okay, yeah, we're definitely gonna use this. Holy shit, man, that took so long. Right, so now that that's done, we're actually gonna go head over to the jungle and try and get as much chlorophyte as possible so we can make some chlorophyte armor. And then after that, we're gonna take on this, uh, what's the boss called again? I keep forgetting. Uh, Calamitous Clone. We're gonna take this guy down. This thing is badass, bro. Who wants to fucking try me? Come on. Who wants to try me? Come on! Something spawn, please. <laughs> I fucking shredded him, bro. Take that, take that. Oh my god! Okay, we're here. The underground jungle.
Right, after a fuck ton of grinding, we have 25 life fruit and 900 chlorophyll. Like, holy shit. This SHPC was shredding the jungle mob. Just saying, like, they were doing nothing against me. Right, first things first, let's get to max life really quick. Boom, topped off, max life. But I'm pretty sure you can actually go even more further than that. With the blood orange. Blood orange and... Oh, there we go. 525 now instead of 500. That is very nice. Right, there we go. That's our full Chlorify armor set. That brings our defense up to 82. I think that's the exact same. I know it's two more. So it's very slightly better. But yeah, this should be fucking insane. We should be doing a lot more damage. But uh, yeah, now is the time that we make this new boss summon and uh, go ahead and fight the Calamitous Clone boss, right? Right, we are going to buff up and let's do this. Okay, the sky just changed color. Okay, it's yeah, it's literally the Iqbalo, and we're doing good damage. Ah, well, that was like, almost like almost all my health there. Okay, yeah, this doesn't seem too difficult. I just gotta be careful not to get hit. Okay, we're down to 70%. Oh my god, what's happening? Oh, we just gotta dodge. Oh shit, okay. It's literally a dodging phase. Okay, 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 okay. I don't know why I got it by. Oh, my NPCs are dead, okay. That was fucking sick of the dodge phase. Okay, we're doing pretty good. We're at half health now. Yeah, just using a mix of these shots seems to be a good uh, thing to do. Like right here, if you can, like hit him with the, the left click, and then the right click seems better for any stashing. Whoa, what the fuck? He, he just spawned two more guys. Yeah, there's two more guys now. Catastrophic construct and cataclysmic construct. Okay, what the fuck is going on? Oh, no, I lost my thing there. I'm, I'm dead. I'm gonna, I'm gonna lose. Okay, we killed him, but I'm fucking, like, one heart. Like, I need to play this so careful. I'm just trying my best here not to get it. What the fuck's going on? He has a shield now. Okay, it's four seconds, please. Okay, yeah, using the left click here. There we go. That's almost all the shield done. There we go. Oh, it, oh, bro, I, I used my adrenaline at the worst time possible. We're in a dodge phase again. For this song! Come on, bro, please, 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 please! I'm so close! No! He's a thousand health! Bro, that was it, he was a thousand health left, holy shit! <laughs> you gotta be fucking kidding me, bro. He was literally a thousand health left, bro. I think if I hit him, like, maybe for, like, two seconds, he'd be dead. Bro, there's no fucking way. I fumbled. <laughs> Fuck, bro, again. Fuck my... Ugh! It's boss, man. <laughs> Please. Come on, man, just please.
dead. I don't win this, bro. Fucking go, bro! Oh my god! Oh my god! <laughs> that boss sucked so fucking much. I was so bad, bro. I, I, I th that took like fucking seven, eight attempts. Holy shit! Okay, I need to relax a bit. Let me only turn it today. Right. Boom. There we go. The <laughs> relic is done. That boss just fucking sucked, man. It was like it was so difficult. That last phase, I died to it so many fucking times. Treasure bag, we have got the magic weapon. Thank god we got the magic weapon first try. Ashes of Calamity, that's a new material. We got the mask, nope. Okay, what do these Ashes of Calamity do? Sigil of Calamitous. This is very good, I think. Scoria Bar, though, what the fuck is Scoria Bar? We have the Core of Calamity. This is made for something. I can't remember what. I think it's the the upgraded shield. Okay, nothing super important for now. All right, so now that that boss is finally defeated, that took so fucking long. We're gonna go ahead and build us a Plantera Arena and try to take them down. Now, Plantera isn't normally super difficult. I think we should be able to take them out easily. We just need to build a fucking massive arena. That's the problem. Okay, that is the entire arena done. That took so fucking long, but this thing is massive. Just look at it. Compared to our arena here, I'd say it's about the same size. Maybe a bit smaller on the, the sides. We have our plant terra bulb right here. And uh, yeah, we're going to buff up and then uh, fight this thing. All right, buff up. We're going to go down here. And then just break all this. I missed a part. Okay, I got it. Uh, I took damage, though. That was not a good trade, was it? What the shit? Whoa! Okay, they can do like a fucking spam attack. Okay, yeah, this this uh, shot's gonna be the best one I think for this. Okay, why am I getting hit so much? Jesus Christ! I'm doing terrible right now. Oh, I'm I'm doing terrible. Like what? I think I'm like dashing into the the pedals or something. Oh, I'm getting hit. Oh, I'm blind! There's fucking white clouds across the entire arena! Oh my god! <laughs> I just thought it could have been my projectile or something. Ah, shit. Whoa, okay. What is hitting me? Ow! 
I can't help tell what's hitting me like fucking 99% of the time. Yeah, if I fail this attempt, I'm getting myself like a danger sense potion so I can actually see what the fuck's going on. I'm dead. Yeah, I'm gonna I'm gonna make myself a fucking like or get myself a danger sense potion. Like I couldn't see what was going on 99% of the time there. Alright, let's go. Uh boom. Alright, hopefully this should be easier now. Oh, there I got it. And there. Oh, and there. Okay, we're almost in the second phase, I think. It's half health, I'm pretty sure. Okay, there we go, second phase. I gotta be so careful during this. Okay, Plantera is kind of slow here. Oh, they shoot like a shotgun blast of pedals, that's sick. Oh, but the, the tentacles like detach and chase you, oh god. Also, the clouds have stopped spawning, which is good, because that's what I mainly got hit by. Whoa, they're dashing now, okay. They have a fucking dash, that is cool. And it spawns the claws, screw it. <laughs> Ow. Woo! I haven't used a healing potion this entire fight, I think. I just was holding on to them, you know. Fuck those close. I I'm just scared because I don't know how much damage this dash will do if I get hit by it. Come on! I can heal! Ah! Come on, they're literally so weak! Let's go, bro! That was really cool! I loved what they changed in death mode of that, that was so good, bro. Woo! Increase our relic collection, there we go, looking very nice. Okay, let's see what's in our treasure bag really quick. Magic Missile. Or nettle purse. Well, why the fuck living shard? No, I think this is very important. I can't remember what it's for, but it is it for my shield? I'm not sure. It makes armor using perennial bars. Miracle fruit. That's a health increase. Okay, not super useful to us at the moment. Yeah, I think we needed ectoplasm to make the Asgard's Valor upgrade, so we're gonna have to go get some of that. Oh, I actually just looked back here and noticed that this, like, living shard stuff can make a terror ray. Okay, we might make that then. That seems pretty useful. Yeah, and the armor's pretty cheap, so we'll have enough to make it. So, right, what we're gonna do first is we are going to go to the dungeon, and we're gonna make our Asgard's Valor. Now, that means we will have a free accessory slot, because we can get rid of the evasion scarf. Okay, we're looking for just ectoplasm. That's all we need. Fuck, man. The problem is, though, is these guys are really tanky. Uh... Oh, we got some ectoplasm. A paladin of the boss bar? They're all done here, so... If I just do this... Man, the paladin's fucking tanky. Is that his hammer he's throwing? Or, no, that's... Is that my stuff? I don't know. Was that, like, Bone Lee fucking dashing around the place? Like, what the fuck, bro? My loot was down there! Okay, Asgard's Valor needs Core of Calamity. Ordinate Shield, I don't know how to get that either. Figure that out. And then Core of Calamity. Ornate Shield is made with Cryonic Bar. Wait, is this it? Oh, it's fucking weird. It's like a... It's like the same color as the ice. Asgard's Valor? Boom, there we go. Asgard's Valor. Okay, it's got no good fucking things on it, but whatever. Right, so what we're gonna do, since I've been recording for like five hours and I'm fucking tired, instead of like just doing the boss in between, we're gonna skip to Golem again just to make it easier because I am very tired and I want to relax. So we'll do Astrum Arius, Anita and Leviathan and the Great Sand Shark next time. But what we're gonna do now is we're gonna quickly go over to the dungeon, try and get our Spectre armor made, and then we'll probably also make this Terra Ray really quickly and see how good it is. Boom, and Terra Ray. Okay, that's a lot easier than I thought it would be. Okay, let's see how this thing is. Whoa. Okay, we'll give that a try. 
Okay, this terror right is some pretty good damage, just saying. Ow! Yo, what the fuck is this? What? Is this a boss arena or what? Did I just take 500 damage from what? Okay, Spectre Armor, boom. Uh, 86 defense. What's the difference? It's actually higher, that's good. Is now the time we say farewell to the gold armor, maybe? Okay, there we go. We're looking very nice. We got gold now. <laughs> that's really it. But, uh, right, we were going to do golem now. Oh. Uh, oh. <laughs> I used the teleport potion, um... For the jungle that the alchemist guy sells. And just spawned me straight in the boss room. I was expecting to spawn like up here where the entrance is. And have to like go down. But no it just spawned me right inside. So I guess we get to keep our key. <laughs> oh shit. Okay so I've pretty much finished the arena. It's not take long at all compared to the other arenas I've had to build today. But um I'm going to quickly spawn golem first. Just to test to see how high he can jump. Because I'm not really sure if he can jump high or anything in death mode. Because I want him not to be able to get up here you know. So uh we're going to quickly just spawn him in and uh, uh, just test that, and then, um, if we look. Okay! Golem actually difficult, not gonna lie. Fuck, that was close. There's no way! <laughs> he had 5,000 health left, bro! I was so close! <laughs> Bro, it's just so difficult to fucking focus on anything when there's like m a million projectiles going out to you. Alright, come on, man. I can do this. Are you kidding me? In this fight, it's just so difficult to focus on anything. Like, I'm trying to focus on dodging, but it's hard when I have to fucking try and hit him as well. GoPro! Holy shit! Oh my god! <laughs> bro, I just to like direct all my focus onto the fucking body, bro. Holy shit, man. Right, treasure bag. We got the sunstone, beetle husks, I the golem. This guy trying to kill me. Bro, never fucking again, man. That fight sucked so much. Right, the golem relic. Let's place it down. There we go. Oh my god, bro. That fight was so difficult. Golem, really a difficult boss, man. Mine Scoria Ore, located in the Abyss. They, they want me to go back? They, they want me to go back? Bro, I'm gonna have to go back to the- uh, The Abyss sucks, bro. So, yeah, now that Golem's defeated, we got a lot of bosses we missed, like the Great Sand Shark, the Leviathan, Astromarius. Uh, so we'll do them next time, and we'll also probably do Empress of Light and Duke Fish One, which I'm very excited for. And we might also go ahead and start doing the Lunatic Cultist, or we might leave that to the next episode, we'll see. But, um... Yeah, we're gonna end this episode off here. If you guys enjoyed this video, make sure to like and subscribe. And if you want to watch these videos live, make sure to check my Twitch link in description. And I will, uh, see y'all in the next one. <laughs>